we're back once again. We're gonna take on the lighthouse, finally. Let's see how terribly this goes. Oh, look, an eyeball immediately. Defeat the guard protecting the dark mist. It's only the one? That's fine. Got him. I mean, if they wanted to guard it, they probably should have put more dudes on that. <laughs> All right, we got a cat. I remember he moves when you hit him. So if we're gonna hit him, we need to do it from a distance because I forgot the last time. Oh, hi, who are you? Aquanox. So glad you're here. If you win this battle, I get to join you heroes and leave here forever. Watch the flaming stooges. Their burn effect can light multiple heroes on fire if they're too close together, forcing you to scatter. If you come into contact with someone else while on fire, they'll catch fire too. Tough luck, but that's fire for you. It's raining! It's raining! Why do I get lit on fire when it's raining? Yeah, all right, so three dudes. That's what I got out of this. Okay, here we go. Who do we want to go for first? Honestly, getting rid of the fire guys first might be the best plan. I don't know if I can hide behind that stuff. Hmm. I just want to see. Yeah, he's the only thing we can hit. All right. Let's have her jump up here. Okay, she can. Alright, she can take out that one, that one, or that. Him. Ugh. Let's see, I don't rem don't think anything here actually has like issues with fire if I remember correctly okay let's see that's the only thing Mario can really hit that's fine there we go and then we'll go to his overwatch because things will move and he'll probably at least take something out all right Let's see, let's go ahead and use hers. All right, and then we'll have him go ahead and hit the cat. So then that way Mario can hit the cat and it'll get redirected. There we go. He got redirected. <laughs> I love it. He got redirected. All right. Could do fortify. I think I will do fortify just because the cat might decide to turn around and strike me. All right. Like, there's no reason to heal her and there's no reason to activate her fire ability. All right. Knew that was coming. Ooh. Oh, wow. They're picking on her today. All right. Let's see. We can go up here. We can use her to team jump over, dash him, and then hit him. Oh, I went just outside of it. Oh, well, that's fine. But actually, if I go here, no, I want to go here because I'll have better protection. She can dash him. That'll work. And then... Yeah, we'll have her go up over here. All right. All 
Actually, I wonder if our friend here. There we go. Yep, that looks beautiful. All right. And then she can use hers to take out that one. That works for me. Although I probably could have used the other ability. Hey, look, I can take him out. All right. 50-50 chance. Yeah, I'll go ahead and hit those guys. There you go. Created one. Alright. Looks good there. Why was there... I guess that red is telling me where the enemies are located. Interesting. Okay. Let's see. If I remember correctly, hers... Yeah. Alright gonna go to the enemy's turn I feel like with this one there's a lot more reasons to just go ahead and let the enemies yeah she's resistant because she has the pyro spark there we go all right oh just outside of range unfortunate what if I can dash him? I can! And then I can run away! <laughs> Alright, we'll use... Actually. We'll jump down. Over here. And then, if we bring her over here... Does she get hit by Mario's loom? Nope, she's just outside of reach. All right, that's fine. Let's see. Don't want that guy. We'll just take that one out. Or very close to, if I crit. Nope, no crits. That's fine. Oh. I can dash this one, though, and probably take him out. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, we'll go ahead. The only one I can hit, which is fine. Yep. Because he's going to come in range. <laughs> so we'll hit him when he comes in range. Counterattack. That's a thing. Or I could just take him out, I guess. No, we'll we'll let Edge have fun with him. We can actually use her heal ability. That'll be good. Alright. The enemies go, and Cat's gonna get whacked. There we go. Oh, that poor creature. Alright. Alright. Let's see. Can Mario get over here? I don't think he can. could. Edge can get over here. Go to Mario. Oh, Edge needs to be a little closer. And Mario team jumps and can probably dash this guy to near death. Yeah, we can probably literally dash this guy to death with Edge. Hi. And it's dead. <laughs> I do like the dash ability. It's from the first game, too, and it basically gives you the ability 
to get extra attacks in, which is nice. And I like how there's less restrictive movement this time. Enter. We'll figure out what that's all about in a minute. Not entirely sure how I feel about this camera moving the way that it does. There we go. Alright, because I am a curious cat. Let's see where this goes, if anywhere. Alright, let's see. Oh! Um... That's a pal. Not a pal block, but a pal switch. chance of that. This room was designed by bored rabbits looking to entertain themselves. <laughs> he clearly abandoned it before finishing, so it appears functional. You know, if you want to give it a try. Clever, Judy. But did you know that when rabbits design a room like this, they add the reward first? Let me show you. All right. There's obviously the pow block and that crab is like, I need power. Jump down. It might have something to do with that, honestly. Activate. Gather all the blue coins. Yep, there's a timer. Jump down. Ooh. Ooh. Rabbits, come on! Two rewards! Excellent! Flu coin challenge. Hmm. Yeah. That'll work. Alright. Let's see. You know, we haven't actually looked at our memories, progression. We haven't actually looked at the Sparks that we've gotten recently. Let's see. Resume. Quit to main mission options. Nope. Alright. What did I just hit? Exit. Right. Ubisoft Connect. The thing I keep saying that I'm going to look into but never do. Let's see. Where are my sparks at? What? Is that what I'm looking for? Yes. This is what I'm looking for. Sparks. What do we got? Uh, da, da, da. Aqua, which there's been a lot of fire monsters. It might not be a bad idea to pick Aqua up. All up in space attacks are charged with splash super effects. Okay, super protect, splash protector. All effects. All right, critical buddy. Enemies with range are repelled from the hero's position. Increase the chance of critical hits from weapons by 10%. Electro dash. All dashes are charged with a shock effect. Well, those are both nice. All right. Upgrade this one. Feed. There we go. Reach cap. Yep. All right. I'll go ahead and feed splash. Gives, like, I like the, you know, 30% more damage, but since we're dealing with a lot of enemies that have fire effects, Splash probably will be helpful. Alright, back. Nope, back. We'll go ahead and feed these guys because I have the ability to. Upgrade. Alright, Bick. Said back. There we go. Upgrade. Yeah. There we go. We've all been upgraded. Mario now has Spark. Well, splashed, so that'll be helpful. All right. Up to the top of the lighthouse to probably beat up whatever's up here. Alright, we need to find the round. And a square. Hmm. 
Okay. Here we go. I'm kind of getting a little worried. Because there's, you know, some puzzles first that you have to do. So I'm like, okay. What's going to be the trick, though? Oh, look. I can pick this up. I don't have to fight that guy. Maybe I want to see what Splash is capable of doing. And dash! Yeah. Again, the only thing that I'm a little disappointed by is that they don't seem to do damage to the enemies if you dash them first. It's the only thing I'm a little disappointed by. Alright. Let's see. Tacticam. Really? Just the tiger? Okay. Let's go. None of them are able to reach it. Alright. So. We'll go ahead and just have Mario stay back here. Shoot the cat. Effective, all right. Yeah, sure, we'll, uh, bomb him. And it knocked him back, that's nice. Let's see, I think Edge can make it over here. Come on, come on. Ah, there we go. Oh, just out of range. Unfortunate. That's fine. I do wonder, though, if Edge can use... There we go. Yep, we'll do that. In worst case scenario, if the bomb comes close. Alright. There we go. No, nope. there we go. Here. <laughs> Doop. I might put that guy out of bounds. I almost put that dude out of bounds. Sure. Well, that happened. Yep, nothing else. And then the ba bomb gets struck. Oh. Well, it's good to know that the ba bombs will still hurt you if you do attack them, if they're close enough. So, melee fighters are not allowed to play with the ba bombs. That's what I got out of this. But what's nice about Edge is Edge is both melee and range. Alright, now what do we got? Uh, I guess we dash to get the box. Yeah, so then we can move the box. Alright. I haven't seen anything else that's like special... Or anything like that in this lighthouse. Which again, has me very concerned. The fact that there hasn't been much in the way of resistance is concerning to me. Oh boy. Alright, top of the lighthouse. Alright, come rain or shine. I guess we gotta get rid of this to get to the pipe, which is fair. Definitely gonna have to do some healing, which is also fine. A light in the darkness, huh? Alright, level 8. This should be relatively 
easy. Light in the darkness. Oh, there's a volcano. Destroy darkness eyes. Okay. Like, can I just destroy them or do I need to get something special to destroy them? Oh. Toxic Quake. Please, you've got to win this battle. I can't leave here with you unless you do. If you destroy the eye, eyes of darkness on the pyre, it'll light a fire. Ah, and since the darkness dimension and our world are connected, the lighthouse on Beacon Beach will light up too. That makes sense. Okay. Heal everyone first. Alright. Destroy the eyeballs. I have... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven eyeballs. Is that right? And then some bombs, bunch of stooges. All right, that doesn't look too bad. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead. Here we go. That gets like three of them. Score. All right. There is a fire stooge somewhere. I'm not gonna worry about the fire guy just yet. All right, let's see. I don't think I can line anything up, which is fine. All right, we can easily take that dude out with one hit. Let's see. I feel like if I can angle edge just right, I should be able to hit two or more guys. My problem is angling edge correctly. All right, let's see. Edge here. All right, let's see. I could hit that guy, but it's saying I have no chance of hitting him. I don't know why. Huh, weird. Weird. Okay. Wait. Maybe if I go over here. Nope. Can't hit the bomb either. Weird. What? Yeah, that should hit that eye, it looks like. Maybe. Be... No, the eye is just outside of it. Oh well. That's fine. You know what? I'll go right here. We'll have her... Go here. And hit that guy. And then Mario can take out that one. And then that one. There we go. And then our friend here can do both this. So then that way, if this guy decides to try to move, he's going to have a very bad day. Sure, if anything moves over into this area, they'll get hit. All right. Pass it over to the enemies.
Yep. Alright, Mario, Mario, Mario. Mario can hit edge and then might be able to get that bomb. Alright. Dash there, pick it up, throw it. At least I took out one eye. And then hide here. Take out that eye. Alright. And then see where she can get to. Oh, she can't get very far at all, can she? Well, if Edge moves closer, she should be able to. Yeah, Edge just needs to be a little closer. Yeah, we're gonna have her go here. Nope. Yeah, her. She's the one that I want to attack stuff. I'll have her take out. Well, let's see where Edge goes first. Edge can jump. There we go. Yeah, we can go here with Edge. And Edge can take out the eye. And then she can take out the rabbit. The stooge. There you go. Perfect. And I do see a fire dude up top, and I positioned Mario poorly, but that's okay. That's okay. Oh. Ow. So it doesn't matter. Oh. Uh-oh. All right, so... Mario needs to take out the Stooges that are fire-based. We want to try and get more than 50% on those guys. There we go. Perfect. That one. That one. There we go. Perfect. Let's see, let's... Let's get her over here. So then that way... Maybe she can get Edge a little bit closer to those other guys. And then Edge... We'll have her heal Edge first, because Edge needs it. And Edge might also eat a mushroom thingy. Alright, yeah. I feel like Edge needs to actually eat something too one action all right yeah all right that's better actually position edge here should be able to take both of those guys out excellent there we go now we don't have to deal with them and she can deal with that. Excellent. Oh. Yeah, she has resistances, so that's okay. Ooh. Alright, we'll have Edge fortify real quick, since everyone could use it. Alright, can we? Not quite. Nor can she, but that's fine. We'll have her come over here. 
dash that guy. Mario, where can Mario go? Uh, Mario can't go very far at all, can he? Mario can jump down. Edge can move closer to Mario. And then team jump. We can take this guy out, basically. Alright. And then here. Edge can't get much further, but that's fine. Mario's Overwatch. And we're gonna try to save the ba bomb to use on the eyeballs. Nope, no. There we go. I'll take that one out. And that one. Since I couldn't really hit anything else, anyways. Let's see, Edge. Take out that one. And then our good old princess is going to get hit a lot again. Uh, unfortunate. We'll have her eat a mushroom too, because she's going to get hit a lot. That's why I bought those after all. Nope, oh, that's the only thing in range. All right, here comes the bomb. And that one. Don't. Yep. Like, she may be resistant, but that doesn't mean it doesn't still, you know, hurt. All right, luckily she still has the fortify up too. All right. Uh, I don't think. Well, maybe it will. Nope, it won't hit that, but I can have it hit these two. Here we go. Alright. Have edge move. Jump. Dash. And then I just have the one eyeball, right? No, it looks like I have two eyeballs. Which is fine. Let's see. Yeah, I have one more eyeball. Oh goody, she can take it out. I think that's all, right? Solve them? There we go. Yay! I was like, wait a minute, I don't know if this is... Alright, let's see what happens story-wise. Really? How long was that under that? How can you jump so high? You do thigh workout, say? <laughs> I'm just stoked that the sun's out and Beacon Beach is back, baby. Well, almost. When you popped that last tentacle, it left behind some nasty dark mist puddles. Also, there's something I should tell you. It's about Cursa's ringleaders, the Spark Hunters. They come to me before you got here. 
They said if I didn't hand over all the sparks here, they'd shred everyone into pizza toppings. My phase, not theirs. Then we will save every spark we can find here and elsewhere. The spark hunters reels will be with us. <laughs> Which, again, if Edge is one of the bad guys, one of these spark hunters, like, the heroes are gonna gather up all the sparks, okay, I'll just follow those guys around until they've collected all of them, or most of them, and then I'll just eliminate them all, and I'll have all the sparks, and I win. I mean, this isn't a bad strategy. It's not. <laughs> Be careful. There's at least three of them, and they're real dangerous. If they find out I told you... Oh, boo-hoo. I mean... I mean, if Edge is one of the bad guys, though, then this means that there has to be some retribution that's going to come towards Augie. So we're gonna have to see if that plays out. Or if they're going to be like, okay, my best strategy here is because I'm trying to pretend to be the good guy. Let Augie not get punished for saying anything. So then that way they're not like, well, how did they know that Augie had told us? They'd be like, okay, so either they were nearby or someone's a rat. The newest addition to the party is Edge. Therefore, rat equals Edge. Oh, goodness. Both ways. We can return here anytime, whenever you need us. Ah, uh, yeah, no, I, I was right. You're my Kuluka. There's a word where I come from, Kolowuka. It means chosen family. You're my Kolowuka now. Aw, that's cute. New spark max level unlocked. Yay, I'm level nine. There we go. Almost level 10. New quest unlock. Yeah, yeah. All right. All right, what do we got? I know there's puddles everywhere. Congratulations, you finished all the main quests on this planet. New quests are now available. Whenever you want, you can also head to the spaceship. We've gathered enough purified dark mist energy crystals to reach a new planet. All right. What do we got? We got... A toll of darkness, level nine. Is there anything in here that's new? Uh, yeah, I need more sparks. Ooh, wait, stuff fell. We should collect those because they might disappear. All right, go back to this. What do we got? What do we got? The Pluglarist and the Princess? Okay, level, they're both level 9s. The Dopest Catch. That one doesn't have a level. This is the Goomba. That one's level 10. Sunrise. Gateway. Well, what's the Gateway? Level 9. Level 9. The Dopest Catch doesn't see... Okay. We'll go check out the gateway. And I'm curious what's in here. Because, you know, rabbits. Oh, it just took us down. Cool, that works for me. Alright, let's see. Yeah. These darkness tentacles exploded. It created the puddles. Please, you've got to get rid of it. Okay, that's fine. Nope, that dude's just happy skipping along. All right, we're here. We'll try it. <laughs> Relax, I got it Everyone take a break. Soak up some sun. Rabbit Mario will take it from here. I insist. Okay, so there are challenge modes where you're only allowed to use certain members of your party. That's cool. Princess, mind tagging along? Your skill at protecting teammates could be useful. Not that you'll need it, Rabbit Mario. Okay. I, I like that idea that, you know, there will be specific challenges where you have to use certain teammates so it encourages you to, you know, be familiar with at least everyone's abilities. That's cool. 
Defeat all. Alright, I don't think they have any sparks on them, so let's give them each a spark. Alright. Shockwave Ooze, also per effect damage is reduced by 20%. Heroes are not affected by Ooze super effect. Okay, cool. X. Upgrade him real quick. To at least level 2. Alright, everyone's at least at level 2. Oh, uh, which ability do we want to give? Let's give him Sparks. And we will give the princess Screech. That sounds good. There we go. There we go. That looks good. Here we go. Alright, he can go that far. She can go that far. We're gonna have him team jump so then he can get a little closer to these guys. Perfect. Counter blow forces enemy weapons attacks are immediately counterattacked. Okay, no, that's not helpful because he's not in melee range. Oh, yeah, dash not available. Oh, there we go. Dukes. So he does have some range. It's not great, but he does have some range. So we'll go ahead and... We'll see what this does. If anything gets close and how far it reaches. Alright. And then we'll have Peach come over here. Take out these guys. Alright. She can protect, so we'll go ahead and use her team barrier. Let's see, can she? Oh, she can. She can hit just about everything. I don't want her to hit Mario Rabbit, though, so... There we go. Here's him. He's gonna move closer. There we go. Yep. <laughs> Everything's gonna hit on him. All right. So we'll use shock dash. All right. Make him very uncomfortable. Take these. Uh, do I want to do it from that angle or do I want to do it from this angle? I want to do it from this angle. There we go. Take them out. All right. Have her come around and dash also. Have her here. Uh, or do we want her here? We'll have her over here, because, well... Move him away. That's nice. Alright. We can take him out. Alright. Oh! Oh no! <laughs> yep, that hurt. Uh oh. Alright. Mario Rabbit. We can have him dash that one. Have him move here to help her jump. So then she can hit both of these guys with her ability. Dash him. And 
And we're gonna save him for last. Yeah, she's gonna get hit, but that's okay, because we need our, you know, rabbit to survive, I'm sure. Alright. And then our rabbit will come over here. It's probably gonna hit Peach. Actually, I might be able to angle it so then I don't hit Peach. That's a little better. Here we go. <laughs> that almost ended poorly. <laughs> that almost ended poorly. <laughs> the steampunk dukes. Okay. Let's see what those do. <laughs> that almost ended poorly. All right, got rid of one bottle. All right, heroes, items. Ah, yes, weapon selection. That's what I need. Uh, I feel like these are just skins that they don't do anything. The dupes. All right. Let's see. What do we got? I'm down. Check the map again. What is that? Idea. Idea. X to boost. Oh yeah, that's to like run faster. I keep forgetting about that. <laughs> Alright, let's see what this is because this didn't actually have like... has a spark. Oh, I lost my party chips. Bleep sheep. MID hippies, demo scene shapers, and chip tune makers. What? I got bad news. Both albums with my polychronic pockets sonnets on them are missing. If you want to get tripped, you gotta find them for me. May your waves always be triangle. What? What? I don't... Okay. I don't know. Let's see. Grab this one. There we go. Alright. Hello, sweet baby. Here's another puddle. Now both of the bombs are chasing me. That's fine. Alright, let's see. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, I have a Mr. Bagheera with me. just like no no <laughs> oh dear what is this oh no what is this <laughs> uh, that can't be good <laughs> that can't be good at all oh boy what happened Get that thing out of here, please! If a van gets swallowed up, I'll be sued for sure! 
<laughs> Level nine? Yeah, no, we got this. We got this. <laughs> oh, poor rabbits getting sued for doing stuff. Poor rabbits. All right. Destroy the eyes. Okay. We got several tigers. Ugh, several tigers. Yep, we're gonna heal. There we go. Ugh. How many tigers do we have? One, two, three. Hmm. Fire stooges. Oh, this is not good. Alright. And it looks like everything we have to, at least with the eyeballs, kill manually? I guess that's a word. All right, here we go. All right, how far can he go? He can't go very far at all. Can't hit nothing, can't dash nothing. So let us go ahead and get him. I'm gonna have Mario use his spark because that's gonna be important. And we will have, uh, nope, not that yet. And we're gonna have her use her shield, because we're probably gonna need it. Like, she'll be best for taking out the eyeball stuff. Doesn't look like there's a lot of enemies over there. All right, and if she gets, you know, Hit up by a bunch of enemies. All right. He's really only good for melee, so we're gonna have Mario come over here. Let's see her come over here. She can team jump. We're gonna try to get her as far over as possible. So then that way she can just blast it. Here we go. Need him. Get a little closer to Mario. I think I'm gonna put him right here. Mario. Nope. Mario can't reach him. That's fine. Dash. And then... <laughs> One, two, four. <laughs> One, two, four. Alright. Nope. Alright, don't need that. We'll use Mario's hero shot. Yep. And then we're gonna make Cat very upset! Oh, no. No more actions. That's fine. We'll get Mario closer. Yeah, that looks like it might be the best we got. Actually, his range is pretty far, too. Um... Like, I don't understand why that's such far range. Those using weapon attacks. Yeah, we'll just pass it on to the enemies, because I don't think anything's going to get actually closer enough to him. Oh, I jumped out of bounds, too. Works for me. We'll just go in a giant circle. That works. All right, Mario... The princess. The sky. Mario actually needs to move up to like here. So then he can move close to one of these guys or try to. Oh, goody. Yes, we're going to charge him up. Dash that guy. All right. It'll be all right. 
Yeah. And now we just need to get the cat away from him. No, we'll get that cat. All right, that'll work. And then our dear girl. Can't hit that one. Let's see, is there a better angle? Oh, I can dash him. Nope, she cannot hit multiple targets this way. Which is fine. All right, enemy's turn. Ooh, all right, of course. See if Mario can take that guy out. Nope. Let's see. He does not seem to have any friends he can make. Oh, I can take three out here. So we'll do this. <laughs> Mario Rabbit gets so beat up. All right. Yep, gonna hit all four. And then he's gonna come close, attack, like get countered. Yep. Am I gonna get hit again? Yep, every time, and he's out. <laughs> all right, good. That happened. Actually, might be able to. Let's get Mario out of there first. Let's see. I wonder if there's a revive ability. Mario is at the edge of his stuff. I need to get her, like, here. I don't think there's a revive ability. It'd be nice, but I don't think there is. I'll do that. Yep, and we'll just send him away. Here we go. Perfect. She's probably going to get hit by something, but that's okay. All right, Mario can go right here. Take that cat out. We'll hit that. There we go. All right. I think we're good. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's super unfortunate. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Let's see.
Alright. And then Mario. Hmm. How do I want to do this? Because I got two of them, basically. Well, we're going to make them both work for it. We're going to make both of them work for it. Maybe I can take one of them out, though. Oh, I'm out of abilities now. That's fine. One of them's going to get hit. And they're not going to like it. Oh, that's not good. Well, probably gonna fail this fight. All right. So he can go right here. Let's get over as far as we can. All right, dash him. All right. And then I don't think we can revive our friend, can we? No, nope, can't revive him. That's fine. We're going to shield. So then there's less damage. Mario, go right here. Maybe take out the cat if I crit. Nope, not gonna crit. That's fine. Well, this is gonna be very bad for someone. he created. Oh, yeah. No, this is gonna go super bad. Alright. Dash, take that guy out. I can go over here. So, we'll have him team jump. Take out that eyeball. Hold up. Let's see where the princess can go. Oh, just outside of range. That's fine. Get a bunch of those guys. That'll be fine. All right. Well... Take that one out, and that one. All right. Yep. Everyone's gonna eat a mushroom. All right. I'm just playing Ring Around the Rosie at this point. Helps me, thanks. Thanks, I'll. That helps me. It really does. All right, we might be able to. 
Let's see, how far can he go? Actually, if I angle this right. All right, let's see her angle first. Either way it works. And then Mario can literally one the other. And we're done! Not my greatest, you know, Mario Rabbit is out. <laughs> Mario Rabbit is out, so I need to change my team around, is what I got of this. Loop Snoops, Osculator, Gators, Micro Sound Hounds, and 8-Bit Clowns. Cheap Tuna has the vibes to take y'all into overdrive. Okay. Apparently his music attracts Cheap Cheeps. Oh. Are you a dasher too? That one looks like a dasher too. Thanks. Call this one fish and chips. Lots of wet pulse mellow. Yeah, a spark of nostalgia is normal. <laughs> Probably for the best. All right. So we're gonna heal. Yeah. There we go. Grab the bits. All right. What is this? Maybe DJ Cheap Tuna will use your heroic deeds as inspiration for a new chip tune. I mean, I don't know about you, but the rabbits seem like the type to take credit for stuff that they're probably not supposed to. A Toll of Darkness. The dopest catch. Alright, we'll just go in a circle, it looks like. Sunrise Gate. I'm just gonna go in a circle at the moment. There we go. I probably should change my team because Mario Rabbit is cool. I really like it and I like how he has, you know, actual range on his attacks. But he gets abused easily because he has to get close to stuff. All right, what do we got? We got to uh, reach the area. This area. And these guys I think were weak against Burn. Okay. Which, yeah. Manage my team. Sorry, Peach. We want the other princess. Alright. That one. Let's see. Shocking Dash. Well, we have a new friend. Let's see. What is this spark? Super Splash with Dash. Okay. He doesn't have a spark yet. So which spark do we want to give him? Let's give him the Uzi one. There we go. All right. You know what? We'll just continue to play with Mario Rabbit. I'll get a little further. All right. Mario. The princess. Let's see. Use her loom. Since these guys are weak against burn. And I might be able to take that one out. Yep. Let's go for it. It's been with me. <laughs> yep. All right, that worked. All 
Let's see, can he? He can. Excellent. So he'll come over tomorrow. Oh. Right here. He can come over tomorrow here. And Mario can jump a little further too, so then maybe he can hit some things. Alright. 50-50 shot. That's fine. He'll come over here. Like, I don't know why that would work, but I'm curious. Alright. Yeah. Alright, let's do this. See what happens. Yep. Okay. I didn't think. Ooh, she's getting hit hard. All right. As far as Mario can go, he can go about there. All right. And then Mario can go about here. Okay. And I should maybe be able to actually reach the area. Here we go. Perfect. Alright. So I've been playing for a little over an hour. We've made lots of progress. So how about we go over, see what's going on with the dopest catch. And if it ends up being a fight, we'll just call it there. And then after the dopest catch, if it happens to be a mini game, we'll do the mini game real quick. All right, what is this? What is this? Think you can beat my PB, ha. Huh? Catch at least four silly fish to complete the challenge. Beat Victor's record of six silly fish and rent a special prize. Okay. Good day, mates. You look keen and full of beans. You ready for a Beacon Beach silly fish chuck challenge? Chuck challenge. You chuck all the silly fish into the fountain before time expires. A small fee of 20 coins lets you ride the roller coaster of thrills and emotions of the pro fish chucker. So, is it a nah, yeah, or a yeah, nah? We'll try it. I knew you were a ripper. A little tip for you. Try dashing the silly fish. It'll make it easier to grab them. One more thing. Don't wander off too far or I'll have to disqualify you. No refunds. To the victor goes the spoils. All right. All right. A whole bunch of them kind of gathered together, isn't there? Uh. Pick it up. Well, I'll at least get the four. I don't know if I'll get the six. Nope. 
All right. Five, where's number six? There's six. There we go. Got six. Probably could have gotten seven, but we'll, uh, we'll leave it at that. Wasn't too bad. Great galloping gullas. That was a butte mate. It's a gold finish. Did you beat my PR? Er, let's call it a tie, but feel free to give it another go anytime. Okay, so you need you need to catch seven to beat his record. Okay, so there is, it is possible, and it's not too bad, but I'm gonna call it here. All right, let's see. Open this. Thank you all for joining me, and we will continue this little adventure next time. I love you all. I hope you have a great day. Bye. Thank you so much for joining us today. Um, if you liked what you saw, please feel free to subscribe. Um, also leave a comment because I'd love to hear if you noticed something that I missed while I was playing or there's something that you maybe don't agree with me on on terms of like what sort of theme they might be going for in the game. Please, please leave a comment, subscribe. And if you really, really like what you saw, feel free to hit the notification bell. That way, anytime I post a video, you'll be the first to know. I love you all, hope you have a great day, and be safe.